Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Jasmine. If you're new here, welcome. Don't forget to hit subscribe. Also hit the little bell button so you get notified every time I upload a new video. So today I'm going to be doing a review on the new MAC Next to Nothing Foundation. So this is what it look this is what it looks like here. It is called the Next to Nothing Face Color and it is a 35 ml 1.2 fluid ounce bottle of foundation which is a little bit more than the typical average bottle of foundation which usually is one ounce so you get a little bit more all right so i'm just going to tell you guys a little bit about the foundation it has nine shades and it retails for 31 us dollars oh so the foundation is described as a very balmy um glowy like a glow from within type of foundation it is said to have a very sheer tint of color just really just brings some luminosity to the skin which it definitely does it's a very sheer coverage foundation but it does have some coverage to it it's basically going to give you like a very slight retouch of the face this claim to give hydration claims to give you an instant radiance claims to improve the appearance of fine lines and wrinkles it does claim to smooth and soften the skin as well as being oil free and for all skin types we wore this foundation all day for two days and i filmed one of the days for you guys so you guys get to see me wear it at certain times sam's throughout my day and i do have oily combination skin and it did work really well on my skin you guys are probably wondering why my face looks a little bit more than sheer in terms of coverage and it's because i actually paired the foundation uh liquid with the powder so there is a next to nothing pressed powder as well and i use both products in order to get a little bit more coverage when you use the two together i feel like it gives you more of a medium a very light medium coverage instead of a sheer co uh, coverage so if you're looking for something that feels very very light like this does and you just want a little bit more coverage or you want it to be a little bit less luminous more matte or not really matte but i guess more satin like you can pair the liquid with the powder and then you can get that effect with it which is really really awesome all right so i think that's basically it if you guys want to see this foundation in action then definitely just keep watching and don't forget to stay to the end and then you get to see me wear it throughout my day so yeah that's basically it hope you guys enjoy and just keep watching okay. thank you okay guys so i have two shades in the foundation i have the shade ooh i have the shade dark plus and then i have the shade deep dark and i think i'm gonna start off with dark plus and then i'm going to see how that looks on my skin so yeah let's just i'm gonna put some on this beauty sponge from morphe and i'm just going to see a little bit on my cheeks yeah this looks like my right color so this does not come in the typical like NC whatever or NW whatever. It is just like dark plus and that sort of thing. Okay, so this is a very sheer coverage for sure. It's very, very light. I haven't worn a foundation like this light ever. It is basically like a BB cream in my opinion. Like it's not even a foundation. I feel like it's a BB cream. Very sheer coverage. Um, it does have a nice glow to it. Like very subtle, but really nice. I'll take a little bit of dark deep and I'm going to apply this um, in areas of my face where it's a little bit darker. So like so this is what it looks like just by itself it's a very very light sheer coverage um very very next and it is definitely next to nothing like and i'm leaning more on the nothing side so i'm just gonna go ahead and apply some concealer and do my normal routine i just won't i want to get to the powder because i also have the next to nothing powder so i just want to get to the powder and see how it works with the powder as well I'm not going to conceal a lot, you know, I'm just going to, you know, do a generous amount under my eyes because that's what I would normally do, but I don't want to do too much because I want to get a really good feel for the actual product. So I'm going to use the Dark Plus powder as well. 
and I'm going to use this e.l.f. powder brush to apply it. So this is what it looks like with the powder. As you can see, it definitely does give a lot more coverage with the powder. And I think with the powder, I would definitely wear this on a daily basis. I actually feel like this looks pretty nice, like, you know, just as a very, very light coverage. I'm going to add a little bit of the powder in dark deep. That way, uh, some parts of my face that are a little bit darker can get that, like, contoury part. Okay, so I finished my entire face, and now you guys will get to see me wear the foundation throughout the day, so stay tuned for that. been about three hours since I've been wearing this foundation and I get up close um, up close you guys can see like this area is a little shiny but it's still not like oily or anything it's just a little shiny um, but overall it still looks pretty good hey guys so I've been wearing the foundation for about eight hours now and I feel like it looks pretty good my face looks very like natural not extra shiny or greasy or anything like that just like normal skin and i really like it 